are ready in three, two... Trust me, it is spectacular and very French. Julia Child is quite unlike anyone I've ever been approached to play before. Her personality is really as iconic as her achievements. It's uncharted territory. I'm going to swing for the fences. She is known for her voice. I'm neither French nor a chef, but here I am. Trying to recreate her vocal tone is very complex. She had an accent that doesn't really exist any longer. It's a, I call it almost like a transatlantic accent, but certainly indicative of her social background of the time. We're all here to help. They paired me with a voice coach, which was very useful. People think it's just a high voice. <laughs> actually isn't if you listen to it. There are a lot of bass notes there as well. Oh, <laughs> she's almost the full spectrum of her vocal range in one go as she's talking. The closest thing I can liken it to is probably singing. I certainly did spend moments within the house just slipping into her accent or her physicality. And it is amazing how they are conjoined. So are you me? It's not an imitation of Julia Child. She's not doing an impersonation, but there's something that changes in her. She seems taller and all the things that Julia was than she actually is. We did a few physical things to help. Cushions on chairs, platforms on shoes gave the additional illusion. But most of it happens because of the performance. She just transforms. We'll be making this show together and I wouldn't be able to do it without you, Paul. We're doing scenes together. I'm just enchanted by her. Sarah grew up as a sous chef for her mom. All of the cooking technique, the stuff that she's doing at the stove, she does it effortlessly. Voila. Just, you know, one-handed cracking of eggs in a pot. Making an omelet without using any utensils. The hallmarks of Julia Child's style. Sarah had that, she came with that. People will notice that I am left-handed and not right-handed in the way that Julia was. And I did try before we started working at home, trying to do things in a right-handed way and decided that it was probably too dangerous. Let her rip! Ooh. So I do things with my left hand, which people may go, oh. Ooh. It was probably the safest thing to do. Ooh. There was something about being in front of a camera like that that just felt right. It was as if I came into focus. Watching Sarah turn into Julia Child was a thrill for all of us. I remember the first day shooting, we were in this kitchen, and it was like, I think the third or fourth take, and Charles, who directed the pilot, said, she's here. Oh, you're not afraid of a little flame, are you? She's a pioneer, a woman to be admired for her perseverance and her commitment to something that she felt very strongly about. I'm not giving up so easily. Her wit, her passion. Let's do it! And her joy for life. Good morning! Is a tonic that we can all respond to and learn from. She just has so many qualities that we all wish that we can instill. That's what I hope I've captured in playing her and stayed truthful to that. I'm Julia Child. I hope you've had as much fun as I did. Bon appétit.